welcome to The Grill Show only on DSL Nigeria TV. I'm your home girl and I'm so excited that I am back. Yes, I am back. All right, quickly, just to let you know, The Grill Show is all about bringing in all the players and all the holds in the entertainment industry. I'm going to learn their craft and what they did. And of course, put them on the hot seat and see if they will burn or if they'll survive it. We are going on a quick break. Where are we? So we're going to be our guest for today. Don't go Anyway, stay connected to TSL Nigeria and get updates on the go all day, every day. Subscribe to our YouTube channel on TSL Nigeria Space TV and join our online family. All right, we are back to the Grill Show only on TSL Nigeria TV. I'm super excited about this episode because our guest today is doing so well. And he looks very calm and um, no nerves, but he is very calm, basically. He's a music artist, has a little touch of music production here and there. And um, let's get to meet our guest today, David Kazmar. Hey, what's Yo! up? How you doing? I'm good. I, I like it when I shake me girls like that. Like, <laughs> we just got to do that. Uh, you see? Yes, I'm not a tomboy, so, you know, I have, <laughs> you to, have to, to be a tomboy. I just have to be a girly girl. Ah, uh, come on. <laughs> it's nice to meet you, Kaz. Same here, same here. So, quickly tell yeah. us a little bit about yourself. Um, I'm David Kazma, originally David Michael Joshua. I'm from Akwaibom. Oh! Wow. Um, yeah. Can you, wait, wait, can you go? Bye, I can't. <laughs> I will shoot sure. my shot to your jolo. Oh, yeah, let's ah. continue. <laughs> so, um, I'm from Aquarium, like I said. Um, okay. I've been doing music for eight years now. Oh, amazing. So, yeah, professionally, eight years now. So, and I got I got my first song recorded, um, I think 2011. And, okay. You know, it was, it's been fun. It's been good all the way. And, you know, everything has been smooth. Mm. Why music, first of all? Because, um... Times are changing. Yeah. Everybody do not want to do the white collar job thing in you know, more. Although we appreciate yeah. people that do the white collar job, but you know, but why music? What, what did you feel um, that called you to music? I just find myself loving music from when I was, you know, a child. You know, okay. I was very young when I. I remember my mom told me I was very young when she told me I. I went to a pastor and told him that I want to be in choir, adult choir. Uh. <laughs> so it's just doing something that you find joy in, you know, mm. something like that gives you joy. Then that's all. Then you convert it to money. Mm. Mm, so. Because the passion must pay. Yes, yeah, so must, must pay. pay yeah. Okay, now from your answer, I, do you feel that people these days go into music because they have the passion? or because they want to make a name for themselves. Because uh, if you look at the music industry and how it has come in Nigeria, yeah. you see some set of people, you know, they've been there for a very long time, and they just seem to adjust to the trends that come. Why you just see some people, they just hit one hit, and they're already out of the music industry. So what do you think? Do you think passion is needed, or you should just uh, have money and you should do music? I don't think it's um, money, you know. Like people would say, um, passion is is should be your drive you okay. know passion should be your drive and you don't need most times yeah, like i've seen a lot of um you know young stars coming up and you know they have money mm -hmm. or they've spent a lot of money and they don't get their song out people don't get to hear them mm -hmm. but i've seen a lot of people so some people actually that have actually you know um invested just very little they didn't, sometimes they don't need to spend money you know mm -hmm. once your material is good and the right person clicks up and, you know that's it once the song, song is good. So most people do it because of money, you know, because they want to get money. Some people do it for fame. Some people do it for just to get the girls and stuff like that. Mm. Why some girls do it just to get the boys and stuff like that. But I think the, the best thing there is just to do it for passion, mm, you know, okay. what you love to do, what gives you joy. Mm -hmm. So when you get to 90, you'll be fulfilled, you know. Amazing. You won't be feeling like uh, I didn't do the you right didn't thing. Do the right you know? thing. Okay, so looking at your genre of music, that's reggae dance hall. Yeah. It's it's kind of rare because everybody does Afro beats. Everybody does the pom pom dance. Thing. Yeah. Yeah. So why reggae dance hall? Um, growing up, I my dad used to like listen to Lucky Dube, Lucky mm. Dube. I'm sorry, Bob Marley, okay. um, Coco T, and. Um, so oh, I, I just so I just grew up around you know reggae like reggae, yeah. to speak the truth you know mm. so it got custom to me and you know 
I just love reggae. Nah. Reggae is very natural. So you just had to mix in your own blend or this time? Yeah, I had to mix in my own blend. I'm Nigerian, yes. so I can't deny Afro. Yeah. So just have to mix and be flexible, you know. Amazing. Yeah. And so, um, talking about music, in every state in Nigeria, rather, in mm. every country of the world, the terrain is different. Yeah. The way music operates in Nigeria is different from the way music operates in Ghana mm. and the likes. And so, when you come into a country and you're breaking it into sub, like into the states. Now, this is a new state. There's how music, you know, thrive here. And there's how music thrive in your base. Okay. How would you say that the competition has been, you know, mm. in your base currently? Is it yeah. tight? Do you thrive? Do you, how do you put your head out of the water? Yeah, if it com it's tight. If the comp competition is not tight, and I think there will be no growth. You know? mm. If you look at my base, like, I'm talking about Lagos now. Okay. It's kind of um, um, competitive, very hard, you know. It, not that it's very hard, though, but, but some, you just have to, you know, put in more work and, you know, bring something new, you know, mm. something they've not seen before. The, I think it's very, 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 competition is very high there. Okay. Like, very high. So at those states, at those states, I think um, there's um, too much comfort. Okay, you know? it's, it's like the comfort zone. Yes, yes, too much comfort, you know, mm. and then um, less platform. So again. Oh, okay, amazing. So, if you are going to give an advice to people that really want to delve into music and mm. you want to use your experience, you know, to to advise people coming into music, what were the things that you, what would your experience save them from? Okay, um, first you have to have a very good listening ear, you know, just and first, sorry, you have to have passion. Okay. And second, you have to ha um, have a very good listening ear for music and okay. stuff like that. And um, I think um, you should learn how to play um, one or two instruments, you know, okay. at least it helps you develop yourself, mm. you know, like personally, you be alone, you know, just feel like touching, like me, I play the piano. So oh, amazing. Most times I What's write... your favorite key on the piano? Ah, F. F. Yeah, you can play too. No, I just know <laughs> the keys. I can't play. <laughs> okay. I'm so, listening. So you, you just um, learn how to play the piano. Mm -hmm. I, I think the easiest way for you to do this, because I know everybody likes seeing it, but I actually started from the church, you know. Okay. So you start from it. You mingle yourself with people. People that yeah, are musically you know, inclined okay, and stuff yeah. like that. So mm -hmm. I think that's just what you need for a start, you know. Then you start. It's simple again. Just try and get money too. And, okay. You know, for that yourself. Go and get money. <laughs> Hustle till you make it. Hustle. <laughs> that is to say, amazing, yeah. amazing. So if we're gonna say Kazman right now, so you're watching, and maybe somebody you really wish to work with, and you know that if you work with this person, your career is gonna be worldwide. That like we're gonna be global. Uh -huh. And the person is watching right now, and <laughs> the person just say, okay, yo, I just saw you on the grill show, <laughs> and I wanna feature you. What should you do? Man, who would that be? See, honestly, eh, <laughs> Nigerians and eh, they have talent. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. see, like I don't know, I appreciate music. I don't, I don't like um, segregate music. Okay. And this, this one is them. Um, this one, mm. I just like every sound. So long you're doing a very good job, you understand? Like you say what I want to hear and you deliver the stuff. But honestly, Sha, mm -hmm. I think I'll go for Bonner Boy. Mm. Oh. Not because he's in real now. Like I've been. Playing with Bonner Boy for a very long time. He's very yeah. good. Like, he's very creative, you know. Yeah, that kind of person. So, Bonner Boy is it? Yeah, Bonner Boy. Bonner um, Boy. Bonner uh, Boy. Uh, amazing. Amazing. Very creative. <laughs> yeah. All right, quickly, we're going to go on a quick break. When we return, it is time to put Kazman on the hot seat. Let us see if he's going to burn or if he's going to come out alive. Stick around. <laughs> Stay connected to TSL Nigeria and get updates on the go all day, every day. Subscribe to our YouTube channel on TSL Nigeria Space TV and join our online family. Yes, we are back. It is the time on the Groove Show where we put our guests on the hot seat to see if he would survive it or he, he will burn. But hopefully, he doesn't burn. Hopefully, hopefully. Are you ready, Kazman? Yeah, sure. Okay, so let's let's do it together. Breathe in, breathe out. <sighs> yeah, give us drum roll. <laughs> oh, that is the most funniest hot seat <laughs> drum roll ever. <laughs> okay, so first question: Nigerian or Ghana? Ah, uh, Nigerian. Egusi or Bolo? Egusi. 
One thing you miss during childhood. Ah, cleaning the rain. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> I want to dance in the rain. Oh, God. But my mother will beat the hell out of yeah, me. Yeah, my mom used to. <laughs> but she got used to it. Yeah. Oh, amazing. <laughs> okay, so quickly spell Kazma backwards. Ah, E M A Z K. Oh, sorry, E M Z E K. <laughs> Your own name. What's Your own name. name. Ah. Ah. Okay, so what is the worst bus stop name ever, like you've ever had? Ah, man. Jesus Christ Junction. Jesus is not. <laughs> ah, man. Yeah, you're joking, right? Yeah. You're joking. I think he's in Benin here yeah, also. Uh, <laughs> or Power or something like that. Jesus, Jesus Christ <laughs> Junction. <laughs> How do we know that? I thought Lagos had the worst <laughs> bus stop place ever. No, in Benin. <laughs> it's Benin? Yeah. Okay, so amazing. Now, next question. What breaks are never fail and what oh sorry what breaks are never fall and what falls are never break? Mm, heart. Ah, sorry. Heart. Um, My heart. Um, look at the heart. Burn, 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 burn. <laughs> what breaks are never <laughs> fall? Okay. And what falls are never break? And what falls are never break? Um, I don't know. Break it, please. <laughs> <laughs> Before I will laugh like you guys will laugh in my house. Because mm. my laughter is crazy. Please, there's Kukumba and Kadiyeg. Ah, I'm okay. You can't say no. I'm okay. People I'm okay. are watching you. See, see the mm. cameras. My mommy said I should not be eating outside. No, your mommy. No, I showed your mommy this one. Yeah. Mm. So let's but go. I used to eat Kukumba. But, um, Why don't you say Kukumba? It's good. It's good. No, you finish it because that's pretty small. Mm. Mm. Ah, he likes it. Ah, mm. nice. <laughs> okay, so what breaks and never falls, mm. and what falls and never break? The mm. day breaks, the nights fall. Mm. Think about it. Yes, I just did. Mm. <laughs> I'm sure most people do not know that. Okay, so next question. What do you call a woman who knows where her husband is all the time? Hmm. <laughs> no, 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 married people in Bala. I feel like they are close. They are actually close. They are actually close. Married woman. Married woman. Oh God. Please don't make me laugh like the way I laugh in my house. But just try. Mm. Okay. There's married woman. There's another one. Oh, man. It's true. You just go home. Why you did know? you get apple? <laughs> Apple. Okay, maybe next time we'll be lit to you. Oh, go go. Yeah, let's eat it. Okay. Mm -hmm. I feel like this, you like it now. Okay, so for those watching, I know you want to know why. What do you call a woman who knows where her husband is? She's a widow. Mm. Think about it. Mm. Mm. I just did now. I just did now. <laughs> All right, so uh, last question What has a head? Or a tail, but doesn't have a body. Coin. I'm gonna try it now. You try. <laughs> I want. I want to use this thing. No. <laughs> All right. So quickly, we're gonna go. On. I'm not really sure. Of it. We'll probably return. Kazma will be performing his hit single for us. The dollar bill don't go anywhere. Stay connected to TSL Nigeria and get updates on the go all day, every day. Subscribe to our YouTube channel on TSL Nigeria Space TV and join our online family. Stay connected to TSL Nigeria and get updates on the go all day, every day. Subscribe to our YouTube channel on TSL Nigeria Space TV and join our online family. Stay connected to TSL Nigeria and get updates on the go all day, every day. Subscribe to our YouTube channel on TSL Nigeria Space TV and join our online family. Stay connected to TSL Nigeria and get updates on the go all day, every day. Subscribe to our YouTube channel on TSL Nigeria Space TV and join our online family. Stay connected to TSL Nigeria and get updates on the go all day, every day. Subscribe to our YouTube channel on TSL Nigeria Space TV and join our online family. Stay connected to TSL Nigeria and get updates on the go all day, every day. Subscribe to our YouTube channel on TSL Nigeria Space TV and join. <laughs> She said she wants to 
somebody Da da ti da ti your body She say she want to kill somebody Da da ti da ti your body And I see you and me Need your company I got more to see Love and loyalty Something about the size Made me realize Sweet like ice cream And girl, you the high like best cream She give me special kind of love Soft touch Pond the sofa and pond the floor Them and them declining Our energy combining Special kind of love Soft touch Pond the sofa and pond the floor Them and them declining Our energy Combining, she say she want to somebody. Dirty, 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 yeah, buddy. Ah! She say she want to somebody. Dirty, 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 yeah, buddy. Oh, no. She dey tell me, oh, no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She dey tell me, oh, no. She dey tell me, oh, no. Whoa, whoa. There's no other way. Woo! How on the clock, like, woo! That was amazing. <laughs> Thank you so much, Kazman. So much. quickly, I want you to drop a shout out to TSN Nigeria TV. Let's mm. go. Yeah, what up, what up, your boy Mukazma Connection. You know, I'm hanging out with Nick on TSL Nigeria. Thank you. All right, with this, we've come to the end of, yes, a fire episode on the Grill Show only on TSL Nigeria TV. Do well to join us same time next week for all of your amazing time with entertainment practitioners. My name is Becky Moya, and until I come your way, it is a bye for now. <laughs>